welcome to Artsimed. This is a channel where I make craft videos, travel videos, and tutorial videos. So if you like those types of content, please subscribe to this channel. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you for supporting Artsimed. Really grateful. So, something really very bad happened to me recently. So I'm doing this video. This is not a planned video. This is just a something in retrospect so my hard drive crash uh, this is a, a WD external hard drive 2 terabyte so it crashed and I cannot un access my files in it and this contained all my videos YouTube videos for 2020 so this is very difficult I experienced this before uh, way i think it was around 2018 or 2019 or maybe 2018 so uh similarly uh this is a seagate one terabyte external hard drive i i was not able to access also inside it during this was my first time um so I just had this retrieve and this cost the retriever cost me around twenty thousand pesos all in all. So in this video I'll show you how I recovered uh not one hundred percent but eighty percent of the files that I have with this broken hard drive in just around less than a five hundred pesos. So if you want to know more on how I did it, just keep on watching. So this is the broken hard drive. Let me just show you how it will look like when I plug it in in my computer. So as you can see, um, the desktop does not recognize the hard drive and I have already tried running this utility for this one and also I use the terminal fsck commands and reboot booting with reboot with safe mode I've tried all of those already so let me just show you here what happens when I run first aid in the this utility So let me just open this utility here. So this is the name of the hard drive, the 2020 video. So it is unmounted here in this utility. I tried um, running first aid, does not work anymore. And let me just show you the third-party software that I've installed. I purchased this in Lazada. This is not sponsored, by the way. I really had... Uh, this just helped me, no? So it's just... Um, just want to share my experience with you. So I got this Stellar Data Recovery from this shop. So I'll just project this here in the screen. And this is a data recovery. You should get the one with the recovery or repair of the photos and the uh, videos. So you, there are installing instructions that will be sent to you. You just install the the program and then you just get it, open it from your applications folder. You'll be shown this um, prompt. So you just click the recover files and then you type your password as a uh, administrator and then you just wait for it to load. So here you'll be given the option recover everything so you can choose which you want to recover your documents your emails videos audio and photos so here i just want to click the remove the email 
and then you just look for your hard drive so this is the 2020 video hard drive and then you just click the deep scan and click scan so from here you just wait for it, it this will take really a long time depending on the how corrupt the hard drive is for me it took me around the whole morning waiting for this to scan and to finish the scanning so you can see in the lower right corner once it's done you can click that recover button and you can recover your files the little folders in the left side of the panel are potentially recoverable files so for the meantime i just cleaned my room while waiting for the recovery data recovery to be retrieved My suggestion to you is while this is running or trying to recover the files is that you should have the hard drive that in question or the one broken to be open. So you can see uh, in my experience I have a window of opportunity wherein I was able to access what's inside it and I was able to transfer all the files manually outside of the program so for me that is a better better not better way but at least a good way and add an additional chance of retrieving it so once i have the recovered files uh there are some videos that you can access and some that you cannot so it's uh, broken so you you just have to try to repair it with the software repair the video or repair the photos there are only two options for the, uh, from this uh, software that I have the repair photos and the repair video so for the repair photos I had a more better I have a better experience with it uh, almost 90% the photos are repaired properly for the videos I have not have any great luck with this one so i think i was able to repair it only around 30 40 percent of all the videos so you can see this video is not broken for this one i cannot play it so as i mentioned earlier all these files are potentially recoverable let me just save the scan so that it will be easier for in the future so you can check all those small folders and then click recover and it will be recovered. You'll be prompted to ask where to save the new files. So you just get a new hard drive or into your Mac. And for that particular file, it was not recovered properly or I cannot access the video. So I'm trying to repair this with the repair video, repair for video. So let me just access that particular file which was just recently recovered. Okay, so that's one. So here, I'm just trying to recover them. Sorry if this is, video is all over the place. <laughs> but like I said, I did not really plan for this one. So there was no storyboard just going with it. And anyways while well, i'm still figuring out uh to get the files please subscribe to this channel this hard drive is still under warranty so i'm planning on uh exchanging this with a new one i think i'll be making another separate video for it because right now i'm still in the process of communicating with the company uh when it's okay and when it's done i'll let you know in another video so as since demonstrated earlier you cannot drag the files into the repair prompt so you have to look for it okay so finally we've accessed the files already so we just wait for this to repair so basically if from the finder you cannot see the thumbnail of your file then that's more most probably broken and you cannot access it and that needs repair okay so let me just show you the recovered files that i got 
all in all because I was not able to peel that particular one. So anyways, for this one, these are all the recovered files that I have. I think this is around 80% of all my files. And there, once you have the thumbnail with the screenshot, uh, that is accessible. But if it is like the logo of the program, then that one is broken and you cannot access it. So for this software, it, 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 it can recover the JPEG and MPEG files, MP4, but not PST files or Photoshop files. Hi, in this video, I'll be showing you how I recovered my files. 